I was born to be on camera and it's and it's not me being big headed and it's not me blowing my own trumpet and saying, oh yeah, I'm so natural in front of a camera. When I was a little girl and I remember, you know, my grandma constantly, constantly encouraging me. She was like, oh, Kimmy, show me what you learned today. and Oh, show me your new Irish dancing reel or show me this or show me that. And every time I performed or every time I, you know, sang or danced, I was always told, I was encouraged so much as a child. Like I've always loved the spotlight. I've always loved the limelight. And whenever I, you know, whenever I was younger, if anyone pointed a camera at me, I was immediately like, you know, like I was totally, I was always posing. I was always performing. I was always turning it on for the camera. So today at this ungodly hour of uh, 6.30 in the morning, we are doing a, um, video shoot for some Facebook ads. We're gonna record um, a couple of workouts from the Sculpted Vegan program, and then we're gonna provide the sets and the reps and everything that goes with it so that we can give people, get a really good workout, they'll know exactly what to do in the gym and they can get that directly up front. I'm just gonna be like demonstrating the workout, showing people what to do, because truly, my legs are so sore from my workout on Tuesday that I don't even think I could squat down even if I tried. actually care except that I'm supposed to now be doing a, a leg workout. I'm like wincing, wincing internally even thinking about this. and six it's now quarter past nine and we're finished and i actually brought lunch and everything with me but you know what i gave mark my lunch i'm always feeding mark i'm like do you want a wee chickpea salad for your lunch he was like oh give it to me yes so um we're gonna go now and hopefully get some coffee and then um go to the house and do a recipe shoot it always has come naturally to me but also being in front of the camera is something that I've had a massive amount of practice at. So whenever I first started my first internet company, which was seven years ago, and it was called the Work at Home Mums Network. And I remember recording my first videos for YouTube and they were absolutely horrendous. In fact, if you go and look up the YouTube channel, Kim Constable, right? And you go back and look at the earlier videos, you will be absolutely horrified. You will be in stitches looking at me. Some people say, oh, but Kim, I could never do what you do. You're so natural in front of a camera. It comes so easily to you. And I say to them, I wasn't like this seven years ago. Just like I couldn't, you know, squat 180 kilos, seven, you know, three years ago, but now I can because I've had practice. I've had continual, continual, continual practice. Bruce Lee once said, I don't fear the man who has done 10,000 kicks once. I fear the man who has done one kick 10,000 times. Once you get practiced at something and you do it again and again and again, you just become, it becomes second nature to you. That's Jack's tea. I got you a hot chocolate. You love hot chocolates. That's what you always get every time you go to Starbucks. No, that's Jack's honey. He doesn't like the hot chocolate. Okay, no problem. You think you're doing a good thing bringing Starbucks back and you're, there's always somebody who's disappointed. Okay. Perfect. We have everything we need. in every single video. Earlier it was for to, to warm up my quads and now it's to well, loose the jeans. What, look at my children. Uh, they're, they're like, Her deprived <laughs> children. Like seriously, look. Sure you. 